Hey, yo, what's the scoops, everybody? This is Sherms again. I just wanted to let you know that I have another part that just got in the mail. Um, if you watched my previous video, this is the follow-up for it. So I'll open this box for you and we'll take a look what's inside. By the way, I am using a new mic setup, so hopefully you can hear me okay. But before I go ahead and unwrap this part, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. I appreciate you guys watching the videos. Uh, recently, there was the, that video that I released. And man, I, it was overwhelming how many views that video got. Um, the feedback too. I appreciate you guys you know, commenting. That really helps. And giving me the thumbs up. So, I'll go ahead and unwrap this. Here we go. Of course, you know, I went ahead and I ordered more Chasing J's titanium parts. So, if you watched the, the recent video or the latest video, um, I had actually put holes in my fender. Basically, it's a, it was a DIY vent mod. I bought this part to actually complete the project because I needed the fender shrouds that were open because the OEM ones are blocked. I went online and I shopped for some. Um, I actually looked at the Axis carbon fiber ones with the, the, the holes inside, but those ones would have to come from Japan. But since these were finally in stock again. I went and purchased the Chasing J's titanium uh, fender shrouds for the STI. So when you purchase these, these come in a pair because of course it has to fit the left and right side of the vehicle. There are titanium washers and the screws for this install, which is, which is nice. I like that. Um, it'll give the car more pop. All right, so here you go. This is the Ch uh, Chasing J's titanium fender shrouds for the WRX and STI um, 2015 and up, of course. I'm gonna take these downstairs and install it on my STI to complete that fender mod project that I did on the last video. If you're wondering, about a year and a half ago, I discovered a YouTuber from Japan named Yoda-san, who also did this mod on his own STI. It took me a while to understand why he was putting holes in his fenders, until he started cutting open the fender vent garnishes which were blocked. Then I finally understood that he was making those fox vents functional. He even made his own DIY vented inner finish rods using the OEM ones. If you'd like to check out more videos from Yoda-san's STI build, check out his channel called Y Racing. It is in Japanese, so you might need a translator for this one. I'll put a link to his channel in the description below. I've learned about this and only until now, I finally pulled the trigger to do this mod. This is where my influence came from, which leads us to now. Alright guys, so I'm here at the car. Um, I'm gonna show you what tools is needed to complete this job. Of course, you need a Phillips screwdriver, if you can see that. Then you'll need a 13 millimeter socket with probably a wrench and a 13 millimeter wrench, open end wrench. So what I'm gonna do now is take these zips out of the body panel. Remove the fender shroud. All right. Throw that on the side like that. <laughs> um, but first, I'm gonna clean that up because it is filthy. I swear, if you could smell the air right now, you could smell kalbi in the air right now. It smells so good. Somebody's cooking some kalbi. But there you go, made that clean, just a tad. 
So in my hand I have the plastic hardware that Chasing J's included on this install. I'm glad they did this because now you could use the titanium washers and screws for it. But uh, I'll install these for now and I'll show you the titanium hardware. So this is the titanium hardware that they included in the, the set, which is nice. So attention to detail, titanium screws and washers, washers. The existing holes is here and here. So what you want to do is go ahead and put the screw and the nut here, which is kind of going to be tough. Alright, so one here, one there. Um, get your 13 millimeter socket and wrench and go ahead, just finger tight it. Don't make it tight, tight. You don't want to snap the plastic. Alright guys, sorry, I got carried away taking some photos of these, but they're so sexy. So what I'm going to do now is actually mock it up. <clears throat> Hopefully carefully install it. Mm. One eternity later. All right, guys, I kind of had to stop the camera a bit. Kind of tricky to get that end piece or that back piece there into the back of the strut, but it was kind of difficult. So I get a washer and a screw. Alright, so don't forget your Allen wrench so you can tighten things up so I can't focus, but you know, you know what I mean. But there you go, I have the passenger side installed. I will have to do the driver's side. Same way, same process. Alright guys, there you have it. The Chasing J's Titanium Fender Shrouds for the 2015 Plus WRX and STI is now installed. Looks nice with the alternator cover here that I purchased not so long ago. Yeah, there you go. Driver side, passenger side. Now, as you can see, the finish shots has holes. So that will actually complete the uh, Fender Vint mod that I did recently on the latest video that's on YouTube. Alright guys, so I have my car running at the moment. I just went out for a drive, pretty far drive, and I can tell you that the hot air is escaping the fender vents a lot. So if you go ahead and do this mod, it actually works. After you add the open-ended fender shrouds, so does this work? Yes, it does. Um, does it lower the temp on the vehicle? engine bay I'm not sure I don't have the tools to actually do the research on that uh, maybe one day I can get maybe an infrared camera or a digital thermometer to measure the temps but yeah it actually works uh, it's sitting at idle and I think the fans on and it's actually pushing the air out right now so uh, yeah. so same as the driver's side it's it's just idling and the fan, I believe the fan's on, I can feel the air actually rushing through the vents at the moment. So, yeah, it works. 
All right, everyone, I just wanted to let you know that the Subi High online shop is finally up. Since you made it this far into the video, I would like to give you a 10% off coupon code. Yes, you heard it. Type in SHRMS808 to get your 10% off while purchasing Subi High products. Once again, it's SubiHighHawaii.com. Go ahead, use the promo code SHRMS808. No skerum, go get them. All right, guys, I will wrap up this video. I hope you enjoyed watching it. If you haven't yet, please consider subscribing to my channel. Go ahead, give this video a thumbs up. Your comments were awesome, so don't forget to leave a comment below. I will catch you on the next video. Peace and aloha.